proud of you. Okay, you're okay. That's true. Ladies and gentlemen. Before I uh, read my poem, oops, uh, I have a, a very nice announcement to make. Uh, good news came this week to our leader, Krista, from the Black Rock Press, which is a press associated with the University of Nevada. I know it well, uh, and I'm immensely pleased that the press has decided to publish a collection of poetry by Krista Lucas, probably about January or February. I, I, I remember in the days of yore that one could open up newspapers and find poetry on the pages uh, mostly, it seemed to me, very sentimental poetry. And somehow, uh, sentimentality has disappeared from poetry these days. It is frowned upon. If you go over the line, you can kind of inch up to it. But if you cross that line, it's not perceived to be a good poem. So I, I thought, why don't I try to write a sentimental poem? or at least a partly sentimental poem. And I have done that, and it's short, so it won't make you sick. <laughs> but it does have some sentimental ingredients like uh, two lovers uh, and the dog and the... <laughs> A, an, an adorable dog and a, <laughs> a lovely setting out in nature and the title itself is very sentimental so I'll read the title first to get you ready <laughs> togetherness <laughs> young couple with dog on scenic path that winds and climbs throughout a park. Girl jogs slowly. Talks on Android. Boy on bike behind her checks text messages on iPhone. Dog unleashed scampers into woods Find squirrel, chases, barks hard, darts back to give good news to girl. She shushes him, shoes him, loses balance, wobbles, straightens, still a bit unsteady, stops. Boy now reading tweets, <laughs> pedals headlong into girl, flattens her, wraps himself and bike around a tree as airborne android iPhone crash in Passside Creek, get caught in rapid current, carried under culvert, buried there in mud. Boy and girl shout at one another, upset about abrasions, broken bike, wounded pride, watery grave for faithful phones, <laughs> in utter anguish at delayed communication with acquaintances. Dog unhurt departs for parts unknown. <laughs> and that's sweet. When I read here in March, uh, I blew the introduction of the band. Um, and uh, I'm an admirer of consistency, and so I decided to do it again. 
Here's the band with cute. 